Positional vertigo is the most common cause of dizziness. Some experts say 50% of people will experience it at some point in their life. Positional vertigo is caused by debris which is collected in the semicircular canals of the inner ear called autoconia. Autoconia can be displaced during a head injury, infection, disorders of the inner ear, or due to degeneration from advanced age. It's not uncommon to have an underlying inner ear disorder in addition to the positional vertigo. Patients will often feel a sensation of spinning for up to a few minutes when getting in and out of bed, rolling in bed, and looking up. To diagnose positional vertigo, a Dick's Hellpike test is performed while wearing video goggles to track eye movements. The patient starts seated on an exam table with their head turned towards one side. They are then guided to a laying position with their head off the table, which the therapist supports. If you have positional vertical, you may feel dizzy in the position and the therapist will see specific eye movements, called nystagmus, on the television. Once diagnosed, this can be easily treated at the same appointment. The treatment may cause dizziness and nausea, but this will typically resolve within a day. 80% of patients will see resolution of their symptoms after one maneuver. Some patients may need to return for additional maneuvers until the debris is cleared. Research indicates that 33% will have a reoccurrence within the first year after treatment. Unfortunately, there is nothing that can prevent positional vertigo from reoccurring.